Hi everyone! In this video I'm going to tell you about my visit to the former royal palace in Sofia which currently houses the National Art Gallery and the Ethnographic Museum. I'm going to tell you a little bit about the history of the palace and I'm also going to let you know if I think it's worth to visit. The former royal palace is located on the yellow pavement stones which are a symbol of the Bulgarian capital Sofia. When a certain building is on the yellow paving stones, that's a sign of importance and prestige. The idea behind this type of pavement was to create a more European image of Sofia, especially after the liberation from the Ottoman rule. The royal palace was erected in 1873 and during the Ottoman invasion it became the residence of the ruling governor. After the liberation, the palace was renovated in contemporary Viennese style and it became the seat of Bulgaria's first post-liberation monarch, Kniaz Alexander Battenberg. After the eradication of the monarchy, the establishment of the communist government in Bulgaria and the World War II, the palace was given to the National Art Gallery. If you like fine arts, you're going to enjoy the gallery because it exhibits lots of paintings from local artists as well as paintings from the famous Bulgarian artist Vladimir Maistura. This palace is very modest compared to the palaces I've seen around the world, but still I found it very exciting to walk through the premises of such a historical building. I'm currently standing in the former ballroom. What I found disappointing was the fact that the building is not very well maintained. It was not painted properly and some ornaments on the facade were missing. So if that's something that is going to turn you off, then I recommend you to visit the Archaeology Museum or the National Museum of History. The building also houses the Ethnographic Museum where you can get acquainted with the Bulgarian folklore and traditions. On the display, you can see the tiara of Queen Eleonore, the second wife of King Ferdinand. You have to pay a separate ticket for the gallery and the museum. The adult ticket for the National Gallery is 6 leva or 3 euros, but on Thursdays there is a discount and the ticket is only 2 leva or 1 euro. The same prices apply to the Ethnographic Museum. This sculpture represents the prominent Bulgarian artist Vladimir Maistura. I mentioned him earlier on because the gallery has a large collection of his artwork. If you don't have time to go to the royal palace, you can at least visit the garden behind it. It has interesting sculptures, a nice coffee shop and lots of giant old trees. It's especially pleasant during the summer because the shade is thick and you can hide from the heat.